Hello YouTube, I'm back again with part two of the finds video. Alright, um, first off I went to GameStop today. And I got Tato Power Up. Um, at Game Exchange, I also went to Game Exchange today. I got Area 51 for the Sony PlayStation. Um, I didn't get to test it out yet, but it looks like it should work. They clean all the games there before they sell them to you. They like put them into a disc and they clean them. Well, they put them into like a disc cleaner and they clean them. So it should work. Didn't get to test it. Um, it looks like it would be fun, but you know, never know unless you try the game first. Um, I've been wanting this game for a while. It's on the PlayStation 2, and it's um, in Television Lives. Yeah, it has like a bunch of bulls in television games. For the place, and you get to play them on your PS2. I'm guessing it's going to be like something like Activision Anthology and Atari Anthology for the PS2. I'm pretty sure it's on the Xbox, and I know it's on the DS, but you know, for uh, $4, you couldn't go wrong. Um, for the PS2, again, I got Tato Legends. Actually, the Tato Legend games are my dad's because he likes those kind of games. It has some games on it I like too, like Phoenix, Jungle Hunt, and um, Space Invaders. And they're all the arcade version, so that's pretty cool. It's not like the Atari version. So, pretty cool. Um, for the PSP, I got Wipeout Pure. This is actually a brand. This is actually a brand new game. Pretty cool. Um, GameStop again. Um, this was Secret Weapons Over Normandy for the PS2. Um, the lady said it looked like it was a little bit scratched. Um, again, not tested yet. The lady said it looked like it was a little bit scratched. Um, it doesn't look like it's scratched. To me, it looks like it should work, but again, you never know. And again, this is PSP. Capcom Classic Collection. Yeah, no, I was kind of like, uh, what's the word? Um, uh, what should I call the word? Like, out of order. I was like, out of order for a while. I don't know why, I just was. Anyway, I had a tag sale about a week ago, actually. I got this. If you remember in my last video, I said I bought a Merlin. Well, I didn't buy a Merlin, but I saw a Merlin for $38. But it was on sale for 16 well, I didn't need it, but I got this for ten cents at tag sale, and it was complete. A boxed Merlin. It was complete, and the box looks like it's seen some better days. It's all like taped up and everything, but the Merlin itself looks like it was in perfect condition, and it does work. It works pretty good. Yeah, it works really good. So there should be a review of this coming up soon. So look forward to that. Anyway, I went back to that tag sale, and my dad drove me back there. He wanted me to go back because he could to get more Commodore stuff. Because he wanted to get another Commodore that worked. Well, there weren't any more Commodores down there. But there were a lot of stuff down there. And for $10, I did get this. But I got a lot of stuff down there, too, actually. Oh, Jesus. Anyway. I got this for $10 there. I didn't test it out yet, but it looks like it should work. Anyway, it's a Tandy Color Computer 3 for $10. And I know that these things are on eBay for, what, like 70 bucks. Yeah, so I just got this for $10. Um, I got a joystick with it, too. Where is it? Uh, it was right here. Uh, got a joystick with it, too. Again, I don't know if it works because I didn't test it yet. But it looks, but like I said, from condition, it looks like it should work. The joystick, it looks like it's brand new. And it probably is because it still has, like, that notch around it. Yeah. Anyway, I'll just put that away later. Alright, uh, what else did I get down there? Ah, uh, yes. And if you remember in my last video, I said they had a lot of the Texas Instrument TI-99 stuff down there. Well, I went down there, and I got through the TI-99. I got Adventure. T 
Tombstone City. And none of these games have like pictures on the front of them like Atari games would have. Um, they're all like that. They just made them that way. I don't know why. Um, Jawbreaker 2. There you go, Jawbreaker 2. Um, Blackjack and Poker. Some of these games I bought online too. Um, let's see. Perfect. Um, Tunnels of Doom. Tombstone City. I think I have that one. Oh, yep. Right there. Anyway, Tombstone City with like a different end label to it. The other one is kind of darkened out and much smaller. And what's this? Video Chef. And I uh, got the tape, some tape games. Uh, the tape games are Pirate Adventure, Star Force, Star Force 99, and it looks like a bootleg of Electric Pass, Tic Tac Toe, High Low, Graphic Fill Up, um, uh, Space Graphics, and Asteroids. Pretty cool. Um, stupid me, I passed up on the tape deck there. I don't know why, but I got some games. Uh, well, I got didn't get. Well, yeah, I got games for, but I get, came with some of the boxes. Oh, here's the box for. Oh, here's some games that looks like I didn't show. Right. If I didn't show these, you're seeing them now. Application software and applic. Oh, there's two of these. Wait a minute. Oh, wait, oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, I'm sorry. I thought that application software was the name of the game. But apparently this is Tunnel of Doom. And this is Tombstone City. Anyway, yes. And this is... I don't know if this is the box for it, but this is, um... Blackjack and Poker. Uh, this seems amazing, but I doubt this is it. Like, the box. So anyway, down there I did get a... Proud to say... Working. Here, let me move this off the way. Anyway, um, I did get TI Extended Basic with it, and it, it was, but I got a um, TI ninety nine system. Came with the voice synthesizer. Um, it works perfect, and it came with another like programming thing, terminal terminal emulator emulator two. Pretty cool. Um, yeah. Anyway, I'm just putting this one down for a second. And it came with the box. Pretty good condition box. I don't think there's anything in this one, but anyway. It came with the box. And what else did I get down there? Well, I got a, another... Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, man, these things are heavy. TI-99, and it worked, too. This one works hard, though. Oh, Jesus. Man, those things are freaking heavy. And I got another. I got another TI-99 down there. Know if it's a surprise to you, but it is another TI 99, and all four of these do work. Yes, they all work. Um, all right, and it came with like all the plugs and everything down there. I'm not going to show those off, but anyway, at the dump, yes, at the dump, I got for free, I got a free, in very good condition, working. Xbox console. It's the original Xbox, not the Xbox 360. It works. I tested it. Pretty good. Uh, Xbox is um, 
Xbox, um, Xbox is like the competitor to the PS2 back then. Very good game system. Um, yeah, but for free at the dump, you can't go wrong. So, um, I guess this is it for that video, for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Yeah, I know I was, like, wasn't really prepared for the video. I just did this because I was just, everything was, like, a week old. So, I just didn't really need to show that, like, I, yeah, whatever. Uh, but I'm trying to say, I just wasn't really prepared to make the video, so I just didn't really care how it came out. I just wanted to show off what I got and everything, so I'm sorry, like, if I kind of confused you all. Um, sometimes that could happen with me. Sure, y'all know about that, especially like in my, sesp um, and especially in my reaction video, um, where I sent um, in television dude the Rick roll. Sure, y'all remember that. Um, yeah, but that's about it. Um, like I said again, sorry if I confused you. Um, hope you enjoyed the video. Um, that's about it. So, um, if there's any like, uh, what you call the, um, um, Tandy computer color games, color computer games out there that are good that you'd recommend please tell me about him because I'd see if I can find him but anyway yeah all right that's about it bye